At this station, you're going to have two different activities, and the first one you're going to use um, is going to be this string phone. Now, I want you to first, with your partner, separate um, a ways, like, I don't know, maybe uh, six or eight feet away, and I want you to whisper, whisper to each other uh, without using the phone at all. Then, I want each of you to take one end of the, f of the string phone, be careful not to pull this out, because uh, we don't want this to break, make sure it's tight, and then I want you to see if you can talk to each other through the string phone. Does this actually help you hear them when you are um, talking across a short distance? So talk really loud, see if you can even whisper, and then see what you can observe. The second thing you're going to use is called the long gong. And this is a, um, a clothes hanger that is basically attached to a cup. And you're also going to use a pencil. What I want you to do is I want you to put your ear up to this um, long gong and you're going to strike the end of this with your pencil and you're going to listen. I want you to take turns doing that. And what I want you to do is talk about vibration and how you know that vibration is causing the sound. For this center, I want you to take a picture, and you all can cooperate to do that, of either your activity using the string phone or using the long gong, and I want you to write several sentences on your blog about what you learned about vibration and about sound by doing those activities. Have fun.